Today we're learning how to crochet the magic knot. This can either be used for changing colours or for connecting the same colour together for when you need to change to a new skein. To begin you'll need two strands of yarn. I'm using two different colours for this tutorial to make it easier for you all to see. So to begin, take the yellow strand in your right hand and the green one in your left. Then you want to take the yellow strand and place it over the green strand and then wrap the yellow strand around the green strand and underneath. Then you want to create a loop with that yellow strand, as you can see, around the green one. Then taking the end of your yellow strand of yarn, you want to place it through that loop you just created. It's going around and through that loop. Then you want to pull it nice and tightly, as tightly as possible, to create a knot. So essentially you're creating a knot around that green strand of yarn. Perfect. Now let's move on to the other side. Now taking your green strand of yarn, you want to wrap it around that yellow strand, so going over the top, then underneath the yellow strand. Then you want to create a loop around that yellow strand using the green yarn. And then taking the end of the green strand of yarn, you want to go and pull it through that loop. So you can see placing it through that green loop. Now you want to pull that nice and tightly, as tight as you can, creating another knot. Make sure that both of these knots are nice and tight. So you'll be left with something looking kind of like this. Now you're going to pull on both ends and that will bring the knots together. Pull nice and tight once again. So as tight as you can. Perfect. Now you're going to take a pair of scissors and trim those ends. You want to trim the ends of the knot as close as you possibly can to that knot. You might think this will come undone, but I promise you that it won't. So that's one end. Now you want to trim the other side as well. Perfect. As you can see, the knot is very tidy. You can also pull nice and tightly on both ends and the knot won't come undone at all, which is exactly the reason it's called a magic knot. Be sure to check out my blog hopefulhoney.com for lots of free crochet patterns. If you enjoyed this tutorial, please thumbs it up, share and subscribe.